Hey everyone, how are you? Hope everyone is doing fine and great. Uh, guys, uh, today I have one DVR with me and there is an issue with this DVR. It's not detecting the hard disk. Hard disk is physically present inside the DVR. Uh, but unfortunately it's giving an error and uh, we will see now today how to fix it. And I will show you all the visuals and then you can learn uh, about how to fix if your DVR is not detecting the hard disk or hard disk is physically present inside the DVR. So right now with me, uh, the DVR, the model number is, uh, I will show you, the model is XVR4104HS. You can see the hard disk is, is physically present, okay? And uh, let me uh, run this DVR and I will show you uh, the error message is what is exactly error message and uh, how to fix this. Uh, let me rotate my camera, hold on. I turn it on, this DVR is initializing, please wait. Uh, as I told you earlier, uh, this uh, this I tried it before, it is first given a look, you can see that no HTD or HTD error. Okay guys, this is an error state right now and if you will see, if you will see that uh, this is a DVR, hard disk is physically connected now we will connect this hard disk uh, to our pc and we'll see that either this hard disk is damaged or fine so you have to connect this hard disk to your pc remove this hard disk and connect any desktop computer or laptop computer i have this cable and i will connect uh, this hard disk with my laptop with this uh, converter uh, sata to usb i have this you can see it's with me right now uh, you can you can connect your hard disk uh, with your laptop or desktop any other way uh, is suitable for you just we want to check this hard disk is working fine or not so i will connect this hard disk with my laptop and will show you what is the error exactly yes guys i connected this hard disk to this connector and plugged it uh, with the, my laptop okay now i will go to the disk management option we will see uh, disk management we will open disk management to see the state of the hard disk is look this hard disk is actually is not initialized you can see the one red sign here this hard disk showing is unknown i will right click here and i will click on initialize disk we will keep it as mbr masterboard record disk one press ok okay it's initialized now i will create one partition or either uh, leave this as it is don't create partition we will create partition inside the dvr so now i will return it back to the dvr and then we will see in the dashboard of dvr either this error is uh, removed or still the same error so uh, hold on let me connect this hard drive back to the dvr uh, I told you uh, before and also I will uh, tell you now uh, the hard disk was before not initialized it was just like as if it's a new hard disk or hard disk is damaged like so this it was uninitialized before I right click on that hard disk and I make it initialized now it's unlocated uh, nine, uh, 1 terabyte hard disk is totally free so we will return it back to the DVR and we will see either it's fixed or not stay with me yes guys uh, after reinsert the hard disk in the DVR, uh, now uh, it's initialized successfully. There is no error message now. Okay, before it was stuck and it was showing an error, and the three lights in the front of the DVR are also uh, blinking. So now there is no error. It's working fine. Uh, if I will go to main menu, oh, there is a password. Oh, okay, uh, I don't know what is the password exactly. Let's see. Uh, so no issue with that all uh, I have not access to this uh, inside DVR but the error was before uh, there was an error before hard disk error that is not no more now hard disk connected now in the DVR and there is no sound of error and uh, there is no message here about hard disk so if you face any problem in the AHA DVR or Hikvision DVR uh, regarding HDD detection uh, you can ask me your queries in the comment box and hope you liked it uh, if you have any question ask me i will uh, reply your queries 
uh, as I mentioned earlier, if there is an error in the hard disk, you can check you can check this hard disk through your computer, uh, laptop or desktop. Connect hard disk to your computer and check the hard disk is initialized or not. If there is a problem in the partition, you can remove the partition and make a new partition. So I uh, hope you will uh, find this uh, video very helpful. Okay guys, uh, take care. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Bye.